This is Isaac. Isaac Newton. You may know him from every science book you've ever read. Let's go over his entire life in 90 seconds. Born 1643 in an English town with a rather silly name of Wolvesthorpe, Isaac Newton spent most of his childhood without parents. This can explain why he was so insecure and fragile. After failed attempts at farming, Newton went off to school at Cambridge. When the Great Plague of 1665 hit, the university was shut down and Newton was forced to go home and study on his own. It was during this time that he began to write his now famous work, Philosophiae Naturalis Principia Mathematica, known commonly as Principia for those of us who find long Latin phrases daunting. His first truly revolutionary ideas were on the subject of light, and he determined that white light is actually made up of all other colors of light combined. Bet you didn't know that. Legend has it that it was around this time that Newton experienced his famous inspiration of gravity when he saw an apple fall from a tree. Yes, like that. His fascination with things and how they are drawn to other things would later lead to Newton developing his theory of gravity, which revolutionized how we look at planetary motion as well as developing Newton's laws of motion, which read as follows. 1. A stationary body will stay stationary unless an external force is applied to it. 2. Force is equal to mass times acceleration. And 3. For every action there is an equal and opposite reaction. These three laws explain essentially all movement in our universe. With all these ideas developed, Newton was ready to publish his masterwork Principia in 1687, and the work quickly brought him fame and respect worldwide. As Newton aged, he shifted his focus from science to alchemy and philosophy. He died a wealthy, famous man, but for all his success, he never had many friends and was often isolated and emotionally unstable. He suffered from numerous nervous breakdowns and a great deal of his life was unpleasant. Nevertheless, his contributions to science are rivaled by few and we are forever in his debt. He was a genius. And that was the life of Isaac Newton in 90 seconds. Now excuse me while I take a really big breath. <gasps>